What is going on? Welcome to day number four of confidence, clarity, and connection. I am so, so excited and grateful that you're here for this series, for this mini challenge and mini course on really bringing more connection into your life in the form of relationships, more clarity into your life in the form of productivity and really getting shit done and confidence in the form of just feeling good about who you are on this planet and what it is that you are here for. So with that being said, today is a really exciting day actually. This is a really important one for productivity. So what I want from you in this video is to really consider, so I'll start number day number one that we did was prime your to-do list and it was really taking a look at your unconscious patterns and really getting you to do your to-do list from using your conscious and unconscious mind, which is really, really important because if the unconscious mind is not on board, you're not going to do the thing that you think you're going to do. Even if you say it out loud and pray all the, all the angels and all the gods and all the things, you're, you're not going to ha make it happen if your unconscious mind is not on board. So big, big key is get your conscious mind and unconscious mind on board. That's day number one. Day number two was agreements. What agreements are you holding? What agreements are you not holding to? And how's that working out for you? Day number three was anxiety and overwhelm and actually coming back, stepping back from that and really starting to create less anxiety and instead more peace and even excitement. Day number four, that's today, is called black and white time. Black and white time, that's so stinking weird. Okay, so black and white time. Here's the thing, black and white time is I really want you to consider and I want you to think about times in your day as being black time, work, white time, play. And I want you to actually put this in your calendar. It's really, really fascinating. So this has improved my clients' productivity through the roof. In fact, one of my clients, um, her name is Katie, uh, found that this actually improved her productivity, she said, by 50%, which is extraordinary because she is so connection-based and so oriented to um, to her family and toward connection, right? And so for her, it was really important that it was like, hey, I need to have play time. I need to have fun time. And sometimes I feel that in trying to build a business and in trying to really do productivity, productive work on the planet that it's really hard to actually do things and get stuff done because I just want to play with my kids. And so I said, well, that's really simple. Like, let's just create two separate times in your day. And so what ends up happening is on an unconscious level, our mind can rest when we're playing if it knows that work time is a coming, right? And it feels safe in knowing that there is time set aside for both. So our unconscious mind just wants us to feel safe and to feel comfortable. And it knows that in order to make, to be alive, right? To stay safe, we need to make money so that we can pay for rent, so that we can have food on our table, right? Important things on a physiological level. So in order to keep us safe, it knows that we need to work and we need to play, right? We need to do both. So that's it. That is that is it for this entire video is simply that. For your calendar, I want you to start to put in blocks of time. Because a lot of times for our calendars, many of us who have calendars, or if you don't even have a calendar, probably a good time to go check one out. We'll just put in our work time. We'll just put in the time that's my productivity time, and it just feels icky. It feels not fun. It feels like, oh shit, I gotta work. And it just feels horrible. So, what I want you to instead do is also put in work time, but also put in play time. And having that time specifically be dedicated to self care, to taking care of yourself, to taking baths, to taking showers, to meditating to yoga, to whatever it may be, to taking a walk, to taking a hike with your dog, whatever it may be that really fills you up. Maybe it's hanging out with your family members. Whatever it is for you that gets you excited, I want you to go ahead and put that into your calendar so you have starting out the day with white time. 
and really taking time to fill yourself up so that you can really go out and do the black time. You can do the work, right? You can really make sure that you're doing good work. And then white time later in the day where you get to have more fun and more play, right? Because allowing that white time later in the afternoon motivates you to work through that work time so that you can go play later. It's like, hey, I get a reward for this, right? So that is simply it for this video, is I want you to go ahead, look at your calendar, and I want you to put in white time and black time so that you have time for work and for play. And again, so that your conscious and unconscious mind can get on board with you feeling safe in getting stuff done and feeling fulfilled. So my biggest, biggest thing here is to always have more and more clarity, have more and more connection, and have more and more confidence. So with that, I am so excited to have you on board here. So if you have questions with your schedule, if you have troubles like actually getting shit done, and it's like, it's a real struggle feeling confident in that area of your life, go ahead, there's a button somewhere on here, schedule a 10 minute call with me, and I'm happy to talk about it um, with either, you know, either be me or one of the people on my team. So I'm so excited to talk with you for 10 minutes, and really Really get a handle on this thing that we call our calendars and and really being productive in our work so there's to that here's to you and to your confidence your clarity and your connection I'll talk to you on day five coming in tomorrow I'm super excited to talk to you then thanks so much